Hello, this is Peter Papa George from Listen Technologies. I'm here at Northern Sound and Light today, and I'm here to talk about the IDSP revolution, the new receivers from Listen. IDSP is a device that has been created for two customers in mind. The person that is using the device and then the venue that has to maintain and deploy the device. So the first thing that we wanted to talk about was the fact that the device is half the size and half the weight of anything on the market. It's very important when people have personal devices now that they need to be convenient and small. So ultimately our goal was to make it a size that people feel comfortable when they're holding or putting in their pocket or even on a purse strap. Uh, having a, a device that is flexible for so many ways they could actually use the device was key uh, during the development of the product. The other nice thing is, is being uh, um, cognizant of the fact that we want to make sure that we are taking care of the people in need the most. Anybody that has a T-coil hearing aid or a cochlear implant must have the capability to use this product in conjunction with their personal device. So ultimately, this lanyard also serves as the neck loop, which is optimized. So the iDSP has a DSP engine that uh, understands what's plugged into it. So when I plug in the lanyard, or the neck loop, so to speak, I know that it's automatically gained and optimized for my T-coil hearing aid or a cochlear implant that has a T-coil. Now, this gives me the best opportunity for a quality performance and uh, a, a, um, idea of what's being said or what I'm listening to. The experience overall is, is supposed to be unbelievable because of the optimization of this, of this device. Now, I personally do not have a, a device, but I can actually use a hearing uh, speaker or headphones and plug them into the lanyard. So this is also, our accessories are also designed in a way that says, I have a shorter cord so I don't have all these long cables and things. It's engineered in a way to be as uh, minimally invasive as possible with regards to all the things that are on me. So again, having the flexibility of a device that's small that can be uh, hung around my neck or put in my pocket or on a purse strap, uh, being able to utilize the neck loop for a cochlear implant or a uh, hearing speaker, and then more importantly also, we have the flexibility to those that maybe don't want to do this at all. Maybe they want to plug in a, a standard set of earbuds uh, that they have that they can listen to. Um, in some applications in church and other places, you can actually share the device because there's actually two actual earbuds uh, allowing you to uh, share to the person next to you. The other nice thing about IDSP uh, is the battery technology. The IDSP is the same product technology that we use in our cell phones, a lithium ion battery. So this eliminates the need for the cost and the management uh, and the, uh, the hassles around where's the batteries, are the batteries good, and the cost associated with it. Nowadays especially, everybody will recognize this port. This is a mini USB port that allows you to connect to the same chargers that we have in our common lives today. Whether it's a, uh, a, a next to your cell phone at home, or it's in your car, or connecting it with your computer. Now everybody understands that this is a personal device that can be charged and reused. Also charging stations for IDSP. Having uh, the multi-tray charger that allows you to put the device in there and actually have them charged and, and taken out whenever you need to. Um, also indicators saying when your, your battery life, right now this one's at 40%. I also, when I'm charging, I have an LED at the top to know that it's actually engaged in charging. So a lot of indicators on the device. Another nice thing about IDSP is the channel uh, naming feature. So being able to actually name the channels of what I need to actually show. This is important when you're using a device throughout a facility, whether it's uh, in a church or it's an educational facility or corporate venue or, or hospitality. I can now actually name locations. So if I'm in the stadium area or if I'm in the performance area or the art room or maybe Hall A, I can actually see what it says by the channel naming options. IDSP is very flexible on a lot of platforms, and it's all in multi-technologies. Uh, um, uh, 72 megahertz in RF, uh, IR units as well, and in now also uh, having 216 megahertz for those long-range applications where 3,000 feet is necessary, like NFL stadiums and large convention centers. IDSP is a great product to try, and it's changing the experience for the person and the venue. Please contact Northern Sound and Light for more information.